speaking at a press conference right now. Let's, let's listen in to this official to this press conference of, of the damage. The city's initial priority is to take care of the injured by completing a thorough search and rescue effort in cooperation with many of the area's emergency medical service personnel. We have continued this through the night and anticipate that this effort will be going on for the next couple days. Other cities and communities have stepped forward to help Joplin during our time of distress. We have approximately 40 agencies helping with our public safety issues as well as our infrastructure needs. Many public works crews have traveled to Joplin to provide assistance with road clearance and other major needs. There are approximately 410 personnel members involved in this effort. We have declared a local emergency and the state has declared an emergency due to this tornado and its destruction. We have seen homes impacted as well as schools, churches, businesses, and one of our local hospitals. We are working closely also with our utility partners in Joplin as well as the school district and medical organizations. All have been affected, but we are pulling together in our emergency operations center to ensure that our citizens are safe and informed as we go through this tragedy. We continue to ask our residents for their patience during this time. We will recover and come back stronger than we are today. Thank you. We'll, we'll be prepared to respond to any questions. I'm going to defer to some of the experts that I have here up with me to respond to some of the detailed questions that you might have at this point. Any idea how many people are unaccounted for at this hour? No, we do not have an exact number. We're still uh, tallying that uh, count at this